All right, and welcome back. So we're going for episode four, Better Beginning. Stay tuned. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so welcome back. So we are going for um, episode three, A Better Beginning. So we got to go to speak with Sam. And, oh look, I got some inventory. I forgot to check. Damn, harm. What did I get? Legs. Ooh. What's the difference? Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Play a little with this a little later. So we're going for combat, of course. I love combat. Flag cannon. Okay. Shut. What I do? Oh, okay. I'm gonna go with shotgun and combat fitness. Oh wait, I got one more. There we go. Oh look, she has two. Good. Charge Nova, I'm gonna give her Nova. And basically I screwed up. Damn it! Alright. It happens, I guess. I'm gonna give him the, the, the same. Alright. So that's it. Let's go into the tram. Give me a second. So, wait, wasn't I just here? Oh no, I wasn't. Okay. What the hell? You're not on the bridge, Captain? We powered it down. Can't afford to waste energy. Though Cryo Bay and Sam Note are exempt. And I told them to keep their hands off Alex quarters. You have access now. Thanks. Hey, sorry about your father. He was really good at what he did. Just not so good at working with people. Yeah. He was right about going planet side, though. I wish you were still here. There's so much you could have taught me. You'll do fine. You're off to a good start. If there's anything else I can help with, let me know. Sure, I will. You're all. Now that the Hyperion is docked, what'll you do? Normally, I'd supervise thawing out the colonists, but that's been put on hold. I hear you're the one helping resolve the issue. Good luck with that. If someone had told you that you'd be in the Andromeda Cluster, even five years ago... Are you kidding me? I'd have laughed them out of the Quadrant. Although, the way things are now isn't exactly what I was hoping for, either. We all knew there was a possibility on arrival of less than ideal circumstances. When you sign up, you hope for the best, and plan for the worst. Crew muster schedules have been posted. Why did you join the Initiative? We're a long way from home. How could I not? I love my job. Coming here, all this, it was just a logical extension of what I already do. But Sailing through new stars, discovering new worlds. What self-respecting explorer could pass that up? Yeah, good point. I wouldn't. 
Thanks for the talk. I don't want to get off this right. rock as soon as I, I request want to submit to. administrators to harass and people to wake up. I'd better get to it. Good luck out there. So. Hello, Ryder. Welcome back to Samnode. I've adjusted my connection to your implant. The headache you experienced before shouldn't reoccur. Yeah, what was that about? You said we need to discuss something confidential. You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seemed best we speak alone. Sam, if we're going to work together, you can't keep hiding things from me. Apologies. I am simply following your father's wishes. What was he keeping secret? My true capabilities. Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows me unrestricted access to the Pathfinder's physiology. And that's... me, now. And only you. I can act as a force multiplier, dramatically enhancing your motor and neural skills when required. Alec called them profiles. They provide unique, tactical augmentation during combat. Your father preferred to keep this fact to himself. I can understand. People might get the wrong idea. Super soldiers. A computer having control over a human. Providing an enhancement to the human. It is a symbiotic relationship that benefits both. What do you get out of it? Though I'm artificial in design, I am fully sentient. Far beyond what even the initiative understands. I don't follow. You're an AI. So what's different? I am a new form of AI drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. Whoa! That's pretty amazing. Yeah, but beyond is. what many people will accept, your father knew some would fear it. Yeah, he's got a point. So what does this mean for the two of us? I find myself in an unusual position. Though I had access to your father's experiences, there is a gap in my understanding. How so? He placed a block on portions of my memory array. Why? Perhaps so when you asked me what his plan was, I wouldn't know. <sighs> And Dad strikes again. But not without recourse. The further you explore as a Pathfinder, the more blocks will be removed. Perhaps you should begin in your father's quarters. In the meantime, unless you have more questions, your new ship awaits. Thanks. Whoa! This is just getting creepy. Go to your ship. So where is my ship? Damn it! Ready to see what Tan gave us? I hear it's something special. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? And final checks looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we used to call that tactical improvisation. Used to? But at least we'll be doing it in style. Come on, let me see the ship. Where's the damn ship? 
They call her the Tempest. Take a closer look. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. <laughs> 14 months late. What? So you're the one who's making everything happen. Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Whoa. Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Are we ready? The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. Yeah. Let's go see the rest of Helios. Hold it, hold it! You're not going anywhere. Damn it! Is something wrong? Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Seen you around. Ben, right? Came here with the family, didn't you? Son still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential. But I miss him. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. <sighs> Addison's gonna kill me. Nicely done. Part of the job, Pathfinder. All things considered, it was an easy ask. And right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. Yeah, good point. Finally, someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about it. Can't believe, look at this ship. It's amazing. I wonder who the pilot is. Joe. Everything state of the art. Yeah. Labs, sensors, exploration gear. Lesser crew, of course. The best in their field. Ah, glad to see you looking well. Ah, Liara. Okay. I'm meeting a lot of familiar. The engine core is based on the Ark's Odyssey drive. It runs a hell of a lot quieter. That's Gil Brody. Engineer, mechanic, all-around wrench jockey. We call this the research room. There's space for upgrading equipment, gathering intel. Router engaged. Securing connection to Tempest. Welcome aboard, Sam. And Ryder, of course. All run by Suvi Anwar, our science officer. Okay. Your quarters are below. Plenty of space up here to get everyone together. It's all yours. She's light, stealthy, and the fastest ship in her class. Every plan the Initiative made is out the window. Now it's on us to find the way. We all came here ready for a challenge. When you're ready to fly, head over to the bridge. Our pilot should have everything good to go. All right, first of all. Better head to the bridge when we're ready to go. The meeting room. You can make vid calls from the central table or just get the crew together. I want to see one. the Departure trajectory locked, Nexus Control. Ah, time for introductions. You must be Ryder, Gallo Jath. A pleasure to be here, and to meet you, of course. 
I'll be piloting the Tempest at your word. Damn it. Quite the ship. But it'll take a Pathfinder's guidance to see us through Helios. Plenty of dangers out there. But I'll do my best to avoid them. That's reassuring. Wouldn't want to lose my finest work to that angry cloud. I was test pilot for the Tempest's early prototypes. I admit, I'm itching to see how she performs out here. So how do I... The console syncs with your implant. Just swipe, touch a destination here, and the nav system calculates everything. Very efficient. It was optimized for a Pathfinder. Everything's secure, if you're ready. Is anyone ready for something this big? Um... We signed on for the big stuff when we came to Andromeda. All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. Command access is transferring successfully. Eh, uh, science and monitoring stations look fine. Lexi's reporting in. Helm is green. Gil reports the drive core is online. This is it, Ryder. The Tempest is yours. Unless you've got something to say for the log. I never planned to be Pathfinder. I don't know what's out there. Yeah, neither do I, you know. But we're the Milky the Way's best and brightest. We can do this. We have to. Nexus Control, this is the Tempest, Ident 2527, prepping to depart. Departure vector verified, Tempest. Godspeed, Pathfinder. I have the best ship in the Armada! To Eos, then. What would have been our Habitat 1? Two failed outposts put an end to that idea. Maybe we can turn things around. Callow, take us in. Alright, so I'm gonna end this episode here, not to make it too long, uh, this part. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, Good luck and bye-bye.